dusty records. Make sure you don't speak on my name. You understand? He said to have another loss of the industry. Is it? What's good, my little committee? Welcome back to another lovely, beautiful, sexy, amazing video with the equally lovely, equally beautiful, equally sexy, and equally amazing lit tie. You already know what time it is. Now let's go. Now, if you don't know, earlier in the week, I had a video that showed Dutch Chevelli's whole Instagram DMs and his whole phone getting hacked. And there was also, aside from that, some allegations that he was dealing with a 14 to 15 year old in some DMs that I only found after I released the video, but I thought it's already been circulated. So there was no point in making a video on it or whatever. And obviously they were allegations not proven to be true. But Dutch Chevelli since come out, it's been like two days. He's in Dubai right now because the whole of London's in Dubai for some reason. I don't know. Like Dubai is the new Tate Modern or something. Everyone's linked up there and he's come out. And thankfully, thank God, thank Jesus, denied the allegations. He said it's cap. He said it's all false. In fact, let me get into specifically what he had to say. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. So you can be up to date every time I drop a banger. So Dutch says... This 14-year-old girl that you lot are speaking of is family. Her dad passed away and I took her immediate family... Oh, I took her immediate family on an outing. Those messages had nothing to do with anything sexual. For you guys to try and push false narratives as such really shows how sickening you are. And then he's got her mum's statement, allegedly her mum, which she said, and I would have banter. There's times where I've been on my daughter's phone messaging him I've had messages which I have deleted, which I have personally had with him and deleted them on her phone, but it would never be out of character as he hold a huge amount of respect for us. So I think what that means that it might have been the mum on those messages. I haven't seen, I've only seen those messages once, so I can't really remember what exactly is on them, but I heard people saying that it was some, you know, like sexual stuff and and them talking about meeting up and stuff like that. I can't confirm that. Let me just make it clear. That is alleged stuff, all right? I don't know if that's true. That's what I've heard. But he's obviously come out and said that that's a bunch of cap and that, you know, that person's family. So, personally, I'm glad. I <laughs> Dutch, I didn't want... I didn't want to believe it. I, I I wanted to wait for you to come out and clear that one. Obviously, the T-Zandos one and all that, we have the proof there. But I wanted you to... To clear up that 14 to 15 year old one. Because, yeah, and this is, this. Is, see, what I found out the other day is that the actual legal age of consent is 16. I thought it was 18. You know what I thought? I thought that when you're 16, you can, like, it's legal for you to engage in, in coitus with someone who's also 16. But then in, for you to engage in coitus with someone older, you had to be Eight, or someone who's above 18 you had to be above 18 that's how i thought it worked but apparently not apparently it is apparently is when you're 16 is that's it it just gets capped off there which i didn't know i don't know man. I, I, I don't know as i said i don't know it just won't feel right to me but it's legal so i can't even say anything to to that you know people can do whatever they want to do i guess it's not that was my main thing i just didn't want him to get caught in a in a legal case because that is not a good look on his career right now so but if this is if it's legal then you know each to their own that's all i can say really Dutch also went on to say i wasn't built to break <laughs> break <laughs> why do you write it like that <laughs> i think he meant break with b-r-e-a-k not <laughs> not car break he said i wasn't built build I think that meant built as well. <laughs> Two spelling mistakes, but we'll, we'll, we'll leave that. I wasn't built to break. In fact, things that break people make me. And he shouts out his mixtape. So clearly this, this whole situation isn't phasing him and he's going to keep grinding and keep going up. So that's good to hear. But Dutch wasn't done because he then went on to shout, say all these dusty Rapper saying my name need to stop. Otherwise, there's going to be another loss in the industry. Now, I didn't know who he was talking about, but someone's told me that he's either talking about Fredo, C Biz, or both of them. And they even plugged me with what Fredo said. Fredo said something about 
um, about that girls are giving people STDs and he can't go out like that and he needs a wife. And CBiz was saying something about how can... No, but basically what I said in the last video about people saying that uh, everyone had the energy of protecting um, young girls when that pedo was going after that girl, but now they're letting pedos like this off, which was a little bit of a different situation. I think it's a reach, but obviously after that video, I've now found out about the 14 to 15 year old rumors. So I'm not sure if he's addressing the 14 to 15 year old thing or the 18 year old thing, but it looks like Dachavelli doesn't care either way. <laughs> and he just said, keep my name out of your mouth before it gets sticky. Now I can't confirm whether or not he's talking about them, but if you put the dots together, then it kind of makes sense. But it's all alleged. He might not be talking. He might be talking about rappers who said something that I didn't see. Because I didn't even see those until someone pointed it out to me. But I don't know who he's talking about. You guys in the comment section, let me know who you think he's talking about with this one. Dutch, I would say don't 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 do it. Don't send your goons after them or don't go after them yourself. You know, you got a good career, you're thriving right now. I don't think you want to go down that that rabbit hole because it's like a never ending rabbit hole. Like, just focus on your music, man. You're doing good this year. You you're you're one of the contenders for Rookie of the Year. Now you've cleared up these allegations, you're one of the contenders for Rookie of the Year again. So I'd say you just just stay in that lane, man. Don't don't go don't go back down that road. But you know, what do I know in it? What do I know? But let me know what you think about that in the comment section down below. Who do you think that Dutchavelli was talking about with the, with that little video that I put at the start of this? Do you think that he's he's telling the truth about the fourteen to fifteen year old rumors? He's denied it. Some people are saying that he's capping. I don't think he's capping personally, but you guys let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe on the road to 200 subs. My Instagram's going to be right there. Twitter's going to be right there. And yeah, stay black. And if you're not black, stay whatever race you are. I bet. Peace. Oh, you ain't know I can sing. <laughs>